Welcome back to, yes, another, as you can tell by the title, shopping haul. But sorry, not sorry. Because see, what had happened was I got hemmed up by a couple of nine-year-olds, i.e. my twin nephews and their little gangster brother, the five-year-old. So they come over to the house with my brother and my sister-in-law. We just all just chilling and hanging out or whatever. Just talking, you know, just, and I already, you know, I start Christmas really early. So 90% of my Christmas decor was done. And they were loving every aspect of it. However, about maybe two hours into the stay, one of them calls me over. I'm in the kitchen. Hey, Auntie. So what's up, Katie? I see Malia name on the tree. I see Neela on the tree. And they start calling off all the names that's on my sugar and spice tree that is dedicated to my nieces, right? Because last year, I presented it to them. I was going to do this whole little cute, fun thing for all of the um, nieces and nephews. And they said, uh-uh, it was too girly. However, they did say that they wanted something in their uncle's room, i.e. the den. But this year, I did a just a nice royal blue. I've already shared that video with you guys. I did like a blue, like a uh, call it Mo Better Blues theme, which I thought was super cute. It fit the theme. Hubby didn't want to move his refrigerator, so I just went with like a tabletop treat. It was fabulous in my opinion, right? Not to the nephews because they were like, listen, we're going to need us a tree. <laughs> All these trees in here were, were the nephews at, right? So I felt a little pressure. So I began to go on a hunt trying to think of a thing to do for the fellas, right? They gave me specific instructions. They said no frilly, no frou-frou in their words. Just do stuff is what they said. Just do stuff. So I'm on the hunt looking for dude stuff. And of course, along the way, I find other stuff. So I'll get to the dude stuff for the, for the fellas, but I'm gonna share with you guys some of the other things that I found for this haul, i.e. the beautiful elephant in the room. We'll address that later, but you guys, I don't know how you, I don't know how you feel, but I've never been more afraid than I was being hemmed up by these nine-year-old twins and their little brother. Like they were, they had their serious face on and they was like, we're gonna need us a tree. So, that is why you're getting said home because of the little, the little gangster nephews that hear me up about their tree. So, we're going to start the haul. With all of that being said, we're going to start the haul with this random home decor stuff, right? Some things I, again, picked up along the way because I was, as far as I'm concerned, I was done with the holiday stuff. I had what I had. I got what I got. I'm going to do. I'm done. As well as my mind. Well, in the quest, I found some things along the way. First stop is going to be at Ross, right? So at Ross, I picked up some sheets. And I don't know, guys. For me, it seems like I've been making this a seasonal thing. Now, I was picking up white sheets. Although I have tons of other colors. Well, not tons, but I have sheets that coordinate with my typical color themes, the aquas, the grays, the topes, all of that. But I find myself gravitating now more so towards a white sheet set. And if you're using a white set over and over again, it kind of gets a little... I don't know, frumpy looking. So I've been finding myself purchasing um, a new set of white sheets every season. So if anybody knows of a good um, trick or remedy or hack that keeps your sheets nice and white and crisp, please drop it in the comment and let me know because I'm on a quest trying to find out how to keep them looking as nice and fresh as I do. Like maybe after the third or fourth wash, they're good. But after a while, they start looking a little dingy to me. So I just replace them. And so being, with that being said, I picked these up from Ross. They are 400 count um, silky soft satin king set. And they were um, $36, but I thought it was a little steep for Ross. But I figured, okay, let's, I know that the satin seems to be a little bit easier to keep clean, in, in my opinion. So this is like my second set. Yeah, this is my second set of a satin set. So I'm gonna see how it does. So that's that from Ross. Cause typically she said Ross is like 20 bucks or under, but I was like, let me just give it a try, okay? Also at Ross, you guys, I picked up this. I picked up these, rather. They are beautiful, uh, like a glittery rose gold candle. I thought they were LED, but they're actually, are they LED? They're actually real candles, but I purchased them. You guys know that I don't burn candles. I use them strictly for 
um, aesthetics. And so these are really pretty. I'm working on a whole rose gold situation. So I got these. I got a set of two. They were $4.99 at Ross, okay? Also uh, at Ross, you guys, I got this beauty. It is a beautiful, like three um, cluster, or I don't know if that's called a cluster or what that looks, but it's a beaded table runner. And I absolutely love it, you guys. It's a 13 by 36 inches. So, so pretty. A steal at $22 from Ross. I could not believe it when I saw this, and I really couldn't believe the price. So that, I don't know if you see that. $22.99. And they actually had, um, I only saw one though. They had placemats and had I seen a set of at least four, I definitely wouldn't have gotten them. They were only like $7.99. So I may simply on the hunt for them, but I love this and that I can, you know, use this all year round. Not necessarily a Christmas thing. I love decor. That can be seasonal, um, tra transition throughout the season. So I got this beautiful runner and you'll see that real soon if you haven't seen it already in an upcoming, um, room tour. So, also, well, this is not from Ross, but it is home decor related. I got these from Home Goods. Now, I got some other things on that trip. However, comma, they are packed away in the attic, and I am not going up there. So, this is what you're going to see. You'll see those later. I picked up a set of coasters, you guys. I love these. They're like a gold trim, and they're the agate, but they have in that beautiful um, emerald green hue, which, as you can tell, ties in with the Emerald City. So I got those. I love the fact that they're all completely different. Like that one is a lighter hue of the greens. Each each one is different and it's unique, but they all beautifully, uh, you know, blend together. But I thought they were so, so pretty. The minute I saw them, they weren't even out on the shelf yet. They were actually on the little carts that they bring out, you know, to put on display. And I spotted them for, for whatever reason. I spotted them from so far away and I was like, I have to have them. So I grabbed these. I think they were um, $9.99 or $12.99 for this set. And you know, these are gate... Um, those coasters can be quite um, costly, but I thought that was a good price at $12.99 is what I'm going to say. I believe it was $12.99. Okay, pause, guys. So, I will tell you to go ahead and get you a little bubbly because she's been shopping and it's a lot to share, but I think you're going to like it. So, cheers to the holiday decor. Yes, I'm extra. It's green. Mind your business. So, let's... Ooh, that's so good. I'm sipping on some... This is my first time trying this one. It is a blueberry um, Stella Rosa, in case you're wondering. It's really good. Okay, so that is all for like home decor. Everything else, you guys, is Christmas related. Or, well, it, it's Christmas related, but you can use it for whatever. But however, now, did I need anything else for the sugar and spice theme? Probably not. Did I buy more things for the sugar and spice theme? Absolutely, and I'm going to share with you what I got. Okay, now there's going to be some rattling, you guys, because some of these are still in the, in the packages, which I'm going to leave them like that because I'm not going to style with them this season. But I wanted to go ahead and get my hands on them since I saw them. And how cute are these, you guys? Cute candies, $3 a pick. I got these from a floor shop in Mississippi called, um, what is it called? House to Home. Super, super cute. I got four of these. Three bucks, you guys. I could not. I could have reduced it, but I wasn't resisting. And to add to the cute little piece, you guys. How fun are these marshmallows? I got I only got two packs of these because they were literally on the end of the counter when I was checking out. I think they were like $2.25 a pick. Great price on these picks, you guys. Super fun, super cute. And to add to that, I when I, I had already had these, but I walked, oh, I got three of those. I walked away and said I wasn't gonna get it because they had a whole section of nothing but just stuff for the whole sweet things I couldn't do. So this is a beautiful, I'm not going to take it out, it is a wired garden, but look at that. Like sprinkles, so, so cute. It was $12 per um, garland. Now the measurements are, are they on there? I don't see the measurements. It don't even matter how long. I think it's like, it look, just by looking at it, it's probably like five yards. So I got two of these, super cute, super fun. I'm going to go ahead and pack them away. For next season, so fun. Okay, so that is that on that. I'm trying to try to reduce the noise as much as possible. Okay, that ties in with the other things. I was while I was there. Oh no, let me just keep with the sugar and spice thing. I got these, you guys. 
from Hobby Lobby. When I saw them, honey, I made a V-line over there and I could not get to the thing quick enough. They were $14.99 and 50% off. All Christmas at, at Hobby Lobby right now is 50% off. And when I initially started picking up pieces earlier in the season, I didn't see any of these. Had I seen them, I would have gotten them already, but I picked up three in three different colors. But how cute are these? Y'all, I have already, there are, when you see, well, you'll see the, the family haunt, but not family home tour, the Christmas home tour, you will see these because they are so pretty. I could not resist adding these to the tree this year. So you will see them, but they are so stinking cute. I just pulled them out to share with you guys. That's why the tags are not on them because I already had them up, honey. They were just everything. So I got those, okay. I'm trying to be a little organized in the way that I put this stuff out of my way because last time, the last haul I did on the floor, y'all, it was a whole mess. So I'm trying to do a little better this go around. I picked this up, you guys, from Amazon, and I'm not sure what I'm gonna keep it, but I was like giving a side eye when I saw how much it cost versus the weight, the dimensions of it. And I caught myself looking at the dimensions, but in my mind, 10 inches was gonna be a little bit more substantial, but how cute is it, you guys? I have the blue one already, so I'm gonna try to add to the collection. If there's another one, I think it's like a pink color. I'm gonna go ahead and get that one probably for um, next year as well. But this was $39, and to me, that was a little steep for Anywho, I got it, so I'm not, <laughs> but how cute is it? So it fits the theme, so that is that for that from Amazon. And I will have it linked in case you're interested in my, um, I'll have a link in the description box, but you guys know that I have an Amazon store and you can just click on the link and just shop and get whatever you want. But I will link those specifically in the um, description box, okay? And so now for the elephant in the room, honey, I could not, I was so excited to find this piece. This is from Home Goods, okay? And I have been online looking at several beautiful um, gingerbread houses that had like the little candies on there. And I thought, do I really want to pay this much for it? But I knew that that was something that I wanted to build on the collection because I do know that sugar and spice will be around for many, many years, right? My grandbaby's gonna see sugar and spice. It'll just be styled differently every year, but she's here to stay. So I know that I want to add cute little like, you know, little houses or whatever, but I want them to be more or less like candy theme type houses. So when I saw this, at the price, I believe it was $69, $69 or $79. I thought that was a steal because it is massive, you guys. It is 28 inches height and 20 inches wide. Massive. Considering the fact that I was going to pay double that for one that was half that size, I just jumped on it. And I've already ordered, I, I don't know if I have, still have those? I'm not sure, I have an Amazon package that I have not opened yet and I think my little embellishments are in there and it's like the cute little candies that kind of tie in with the theme, with the look of these. So I'm gonna just kind of like, you know, embellish the house to give it that whole candy land looking feel. So that is that on that, okay? So that is it for my candy land, or not candy, that's in for my sugar and spice decor. So here is just random ribbon, you guys. I tell you all the time, you know, ribbon can make or break a look. And so you want to fill up your tree and not have to buy a lot of ornaments or if you're not into the deco, man, because I know some people feel, you know, a certain way about it. Some people love it, some people hate it. But ribbon is just like a quintessential addition to Christmas tree. You don't have to add it, but it definitely adds a level of elegance and um, just glam or fun to a tree, depending on your theme. So here I picked up just some that I use on a regular basis, making wreaths and swags and garlands and things like that. The traditional Christmas colors are my number one request. So I always buy tons of the red. So I thought this was super, super cute. Candyland has been really, really hot this year. One of my number one requested things. So I picked up more. I think I got like four of these. I thought I had some in the green. I may have already used them in an order, but I got four of these, right? That was the only one for like commercial. The rest of these are for my personal collection, okay? So what I have been loving lately, you guys, is all things gunmetal and charcoal. Don't know why they just catch my eye, but I picked up this beautiful ribbon in like a charcoal theme, and it's like a, it has like a sheen to it. I won't say it's a silk or satin, but it's really, really pretty. And these were only $4.75 a roll, and it's a 10-yard roll, and the brand is Expressions. And I've used this brand of ribbon quite a bit, and they do very, very well for me. So if you're interested, there is the brand. If you want to Google, like I said, I got this at a local um, florist shop, and I'm sure a shop in your area might carry it as well. So I will put those there. If I can find them in the Amazon, um, in my Amazon, so I will link them as well. But they're super cute. I got those. 
again tying in with that whole gunmetal and metallic look i found this beautiful ribbon and it has like a a leaf pattern on it and it's in the beautiful hues of like a cream with gunmetal and soft golds and silver it's just really really pretty and it would tie in well with this particular ribbon actually if you wanted to do like a whole rustic like a lodge type of feel, log cabin feel. I think that would be really pretty. So I love this. I didn't get it particularly with Christmas in mind. I've got like winter themes and fall themes on the brain. So I, when I saw this, I thought automatically like winter refresh is what I was thinking, but it's super cute. So I picked up two of these and they were, guys, a four inch ribbon was only $5, five twenty five. dollars So again, this is that, that Expressions brand, super cute, super fun. And it is a good quality, um, it's like a tweed and then like the leaf pattern. I'm gonna try to put, but the leaf pattern is more of a sheen on top of that tweed, which is really, really pretty. So there's a lot of detail in this ribbon. Cause not all ribbons is created the same. And you'll see as I continue to share with you different levels and different grades of ribbon. So there's ribbon and then there's three bone, okay? So this is a really nice high quality ribbon at $5.75, okay? Okay, I gotta stretch this leg out y'all cause this one sits up. Hold on, let me reposition myself. Okay, which bag was I in? I was in there. This bag goes over here. Okay, also tying in with the ribbon, with the ribbon. This is ribbon. Oh, these are slightly different. I just noticed that. I thought they were the same. Um, one of them, I had purchased this one um, a few weeks ago, and I think I shared it with you guys. And it's a beautiful aqua. You guys know my love for all things Tiffany blue, and so I love this color. And this is going to be my theme for my bedroom this year. I've decided this is because I was really torn on the bedroom. This is why I hadn't shared it with you guys about the bedroom because I ain't no deuces. But I'm going to go with this. And then this one is a little bit more, I don't know. That one looks a lighter. They certainly go on the same tree, but they, there's a little difference in this, you can tell. Both of them, well, this one was $6 a roll. And this one was, I'm assuming it was $4. It's the same as that one, $4.75. Because there's not a price there's, there's not a price on this one. But it's also by the Expressions brand. This one is the RG ribbon, which is also another good brand. I do a lot of reefs with these. Um, okay, there's another one of those. I got two more of these. I actually had already had one and I went back and got another one. This is some beautiful ribbon, you guys, and it comes in a variety of colors. I already did a project with it and I didn't share it with you guys, but it was red and silver. And it's the same ribbon, but it's in red and silver. And this is this beautiful mint green and silver ribbon by RG. Um, ribbon, really, really nice. I love this quality ribbon. And it was $9 a roll. Super, super cute. But I don't know, which one? I think this one ties in better with that. I think this is a little dark, but we'll see. I got tons of other ribbon to coordinate, so that is that. Okay. I probably need to keep this all together so I don't make a whole mess over here. I'm trying to do better. I'm telling y'all, last time it was a hot mess trying to clean all that mess up, so I'm trying to be neat as I can <laughs> this go around. Okay. And then this, you guys, again, I have several holidays. Let me throw that over there. Several holidays on the brain, right? So this beautiful rust color or whiskey color is going to be um, probably in my fall 22 thing but i love it you guys and when i saw the price of this beautiful thick ribbon and it is also it's not it's not a velvet but it's really pretty only six dollars you guys for this and i picked up two of those okay i'm gonna leave this to the side because i want to share with you something else that i picked up to tie in with okay so that is all for like just random ribbon stuff. So now we're gonna get, well I did do the candy, the sugar and spice thing. I'm gonna save the fellas thing for last. So I'm gonna go now to, oh, where I wanna go. Okay, let's go here. I went to um, two of my favorite places, right? So one of them is called, it's a, um, a Christmas warehouse that they open up once a year in my area. And for like maybe two months, it's just massive, over the top holiday decor, right? And so they have some beautiful items in there. And I, remember, I took you guys on the on, on the tour with me, the guest company. That's where it was. And so I went out there the first time, and I got a few items. But I also went to scope out the land because the little birdie told me that they do an early sale um, before the most most people do like a Black Friday. Well, they do their sale the day before Black Friday. So. Um, you're seeing this on, I'm actually filming on Thanksgiving. 
and you I went over there yesterday because the sale was the day before so it was yesterday so I just purchased these you guys and 40% off the entire warehouse was now 40% off and I just was over there a few weeks ago which is like the first part of November so if you sometimes if you just wait it out if you go scope out a place and then wait it out they'll put things on sale so that is what happened in this case but some of the things I needed you know beforehand so I had to get them but even at the regular price you guys it has amazing deals so I'm not mad at purchasing those items at full price but I'm even happier at purchasing them at 40% off and I picked up tying in with this whole rose gold situation that I've got going or that I'm establishing I picked up these beautiful um magnolias so pretty so so pretty and this is more of a it's rose gold but it's giving me like a bronzy look as well which I do love because you can mix your metallics actually how would that look you can almost make anything do anything because this has like a little bit of a bronzy hue to the ribbon. So, but that's not going to go together. I was just kind of sharing with you, but I love these. They were $3.99 guys at 40% off. And so I picked up, I think 10 of them. I think I picked up 10 of them. I got a hint. Let me see. Two, three, four, five. And yeah, there's some more over there. So I think I got 10 of these at $3.99 and 40% off. So, so pretty. I ain't mad at it. I ain't mad at it. Okay. Again, I'm going to try to do this neatly. So stuff ain't just everywhere right so also from the guest warehouse i picked up or the christmas warehouse i picked these up again fall on the brain okay these beautiful floral picks and they had some gorgeous displays of like your richer tones this season like last time i went there was all about the bright christmasy greens and all of those things but this year they had a variety of colors to fit everyone's taste right so these are just so, so pretty to me. Different hues of the burnt orange, the rust color, that whiskey color that I am loving right now, all in one pick. They were $3.99 at 40% off. And look at how pretty. Building my theme, you guys. This is Christmas decor, but it definitely can be styled for the fall season. So I'm going to be using this for the fall. And I got 10 of these as well. When I see a good deal, honey, she jumps on it. So I got 10 of those. Okay, I'm gonna set that there. Don't pop. You stay right there. Okay. Also tying in with that whole, since we're on that fall feel, look and feel, I saw this and I could not resist. How gorgeous, you guys! This is a beautiful um, plaid and the burnt oranges and greens and just pretty, really, really pretty and bronzy color. This was. $19 at 40% off. Again, it is a higher quality ribbon, so it's going to give you a totally different look. Look at that. It's so pretty together. I'm trying to pull the one that I just fluffed out. I can't. It's on the bottom. But look at how pretty that is. So cute. Fall is going to be amazing. Plan ahead. I tell you guys all the time, plan your looks out so you take inventory of what you have, scope out the stores, and strategize. That's what I do to get the biggest bang for my buck when I'm doing things in my home and in other clients not just my home but in, in clients homes as well right so now let's go to the ornaments and then i'll share with you those we've owned, okay well no let's now go to the fellas so for the fellas right i was really really twirling in my mind trying to think about what to do for these little boys because they were serious right and then it came to me i have Fancy, y'all. You guys know fancy, and it's like a pretty little. I might put a picture of fancy. I did a, and the, the theme on that was called um, peppermint twist, which is what's gonna. The theme of this is going to be called for the guys. It's gonna be called peppermint twist. Okay, it's a masculine version of peppermint twist. And so I have fancy, and I thought, how can I build on what I already have? I'm a stickler for that. I don't want to have to go out and just buy all new stuff. I want to be able to build on something that I already have. So I knew that I had all of the pretty like candy cane things. And I had a little bit of the teal, so it's not like a girly blue because they wasn't feeling that Tiffany blue, but they were okay with the darker hues of the twisted pepper, but peppermint twist. So I thought, how can I incorporate that and make it masculine to fit the fellas, right? And so I shared with you guys a few weeks ago a theme that I was putting together, not knowing that she was going to be using it herself. So twisted peppermint is getting a masculine flair, or peppermint twist is getting a masculine flair. So I picked up this super cute. Um, red, white, and blue, or it's turquoise um, deco mesh. And I thought, okay, we can, now we can we can build on something, right? And I was just thinking of peppermint with the snowman, but I'm gonna share with you how I found some amazing pieces that make it even more masculine yet fun. 
for the fellas, okay? So I also share with you guys this cute ribbon here that says um, Christmas is for something. I don't know what all the... A C is for Christmas or something is for Christmas, but super cute in the blue and the red, right? Then, when I saw this, this is kind of what started bringing my whole little look and vibe together. It is the snowman, the top hat with the blue and the black. That black always reads to me more masculine and more strong. So I thought, how cute and how fun would that be? Okay. Then I share with you guys these super cute little snowmen from Walmart, you guys. 98 cents. So I'm going to have to go back and get tons more of these, right? I think I got like maybe five, four or five of them. But I want to have at least um, 10. So I'm going to go back and pick that up. They're only 98 cents. Hopefully I can find some more. Super, super cute. So here we go. Y'all seeing? So this is what, along with fancy, that I already have and the things I already have, that is what I was like, I can make that tree be masculine, right? And so I'm going to do them some custom ornaments. Like, I think I'm going to do the ornaments in like black and put their names in red, the blues, and the white to tie it all in. But again, that black will keep it grounded and very, very um, masculine, right? So now, now, now we have a theme in mind. So let me share with you, once I established that theme, how everything began to just literally fall in place. I was in my craft store and guys, I saw these and I like to have lost it. I was so excited. And I lost it in a good way, right? Look at this. How cute and fun are these? Look at this. Do you, you, you see? Do you see it coming together, okay? So I got these, they were $5.99 and I got 20% off on those, right? As if that were not perfect enough because it's highs in the black with the whole blue and the red and white, right? Look at how cute, you guys. Look at this. Sis, we getting somewhere. We getting somewhere. So this, again, ties in so perfectly with the snowman. I'm trying to, trying to hold up as much of this on my finger as I can. I ain't got but five fingers, so something I have to give. But I just want you to see how, you know, once you put, look at that, so stinking cute. Once you put a look together and just start building on it, stay cohesive with it, it turns out amazing, okay? You got that. This will be your anchor, okay? As if these were not enough, y'all. Look, look what I found. Yes, look, y'all, come on. Baby, this, it was all in the plan for this, for, um, peppermint twist to come to life or come back to life y'all were asking about fancy well fancy's coming back so i'm gonna i don't know if i'm gonna take down more better blues and put fancy up or find somewhere else for fan for um peppermint twist but definitely you will be seeing it because some of the fellas were not playing so i got that for them and i think i picked up five of the black right and i picked up five of the white and because these were so big i don't think i only got Three of them. Let's see. Or maybe even two. Let me see what I got. Looks like I have two, but I, I think I'm going to like to go back and get another one of those. And then, as if that wasn't enough, y'all, it just kept getting better and better and better. Look at this. Look at that. So sticky cute. So fun. Oh, let me tell you the prices of these, you guys. Okay, these were $8.99 at 20% off. Okay. These were. Oh, how much for you, sis? These were $13.99 at 20% off, okay? These are $8.99 at 20% um, off. And this is from a local craft store. So, in all of them, I got odd numbers. I got two of the big ones. I got, looks like seven of these, seven of these, and then I got five of these, okay? So cute, so fun, right? But y'all. When I thought I had, just when I thought I had got as fast as I was as I was gonna get for the fellas, for peppermint twist, look at what I found. Now these you guys were from a different store. This is from the Christmas Warehouse. How absolutely amazing is this? And you may be saying, Trevina, that's a totally different pattern. I know, sis. I know because you want to bring in. Look at that. Different looks, different elements, different layers, and just. Look at that. Look at that. How fun, you 
guys. Look at this. Uh-oh. And then I'm going to add their custom ornaments on top of these. So pretty. Look at that. Look at that. Just flat out amazing. I'm so excited for them. I can't wait to see the look on their little faces when they come back and their tree is up because I'm not trying to get jumped on by a set of twins and a five-year-old. How fun, you guys. So sneaky cute. And then to add to this, you guys, I knew that I already have some black and white polka dot ribbons. I have some, not ribbons, ornaments. I have some black and white pinstripe ornaments. I have some more red and white candy canes. So all of those patterns mixed together is going to equal a whole lot of fun for the fellas. So they better be loving on their auntie. So cute. And you guys, on top of that, I ordered something that I had always wanted to get anyways, but every season, I think maybe three seasons in a row, I pulled the plug on it. I was like, no, don't get it. You don't need it. Don't do it. But this time, I, when I started with this theme, I was like, that will be perfect. And it is none other than this. It is not here yet. It is saying it's on the way. So as soon as it gets here, I will be styling with you guys this beautiful black Christmas tree. And the beauty of it is that I'm not only going to use it for their tree, but think about New Year's. Think about Valentine's. If you're a person that styles with, you know, for the seasons, this will be amazing. So you will see Blackie in several of my seasonal stylings. I'm so excited, you guys, to do this for them. I know they're going to love it. Well, they better love it because I ain't trying to be jealous, okay? So I have a few more things to share from that, and then I've got a few more things to share after that. I told you it was going to be a long one because your girl been hitting these streets, okay? It seemed like every time I went to shop a source for a client's look, I ended up finding a few pieces for myself, and the few pieces just built up to a whole massive the situation that you're seeing it right now, okay? And so also, tying in with the whole twisted peppermint of it all with the top hats or the snowman hats being the theme. I got these beauties. This is, I love these because they're red and white, but they, they're, the top hats are red and white, pinstripe and not your typical black. So I love that. So I got um, three of the pinstripe, no, two of the pinstripe. Uh oh. And then I got three with the polka dot. Again, it's all about mixing patterns and different themes and textures. This is going to be so much fun for them. I cannot wait to do this tree. So that is that, okay? So keeping in now with the topper of it all. How fun and whimsical are these pictures, guys? Oh, I'm sorry, let me tell you the price of these. I didn't tell you the price of this one, okay. Back it up, back it up, back it up. This was $24, $24.99 at 40% off, okay? From the guest warehouse. Yeah, I keep this lid is going to sleep on me. Okay. And then these are $7.99 at 40% off. Okay. And so these I picked up from the warehouse in Mississippi, House to Home. They were $7.25 and I absolutely love them. Okay. They are, I got how many? One, two, three, four of these, I think. Yeah. I got four of these. Think of how fun this is gonna be mixed with these. Look at that already just, and I have some blue picks already, like a solid blue to bring that pop of blue in there. And then to add to that, I got these cute swirly black ones. So stinky. I left all of them in the wrapper because I ain't trying to have glitter everywhere. We've been vacuuming for days trying to get glitter up for me doing all of my Christmas styling. These were 425, you guys, and I picked up four of them as well. So, Peppermint Twist is going to get a masculine refresh and it is going to be all kinds of fun. I hope you guys come back and catch that video. In the event that I don't do it this year, just know that it will be done um, next year for sure. But it's on my radar to do this year, okay? Uh -oh. And so now, the final things of this haul, you guys, as I told you, there is a ribbon and then there is a ribbon, right? But I wanna share with you and I showed you everything. Yeah, I showed you everything from the, from the peppermint twist. And I showed you everything from the sugar and spice, right? So, I know from planning my season, my things for next year, that I'm going to need a little bit more gold and ivory and gold decor for what I want to do. Because I have some beautiful things in mind. So, I picked up these beauties. When I saw them, I knew that they would be perfect. I wish they had them in a slightly larger size. And I think they did, but by the time I got there for the 40% off, they were already gone. And they were $3.99 at 40% off. So I got 10 of these. I really should have gotten more, but they're so pretty. I actually can stick them in here somewhere. Let me see. No, it'll be this spot in here. Cuteness. Yeah. 
So I got those. Then I got, I had my eyes on these when I went and I didn't get any because I was like, I'm not here for me. But the price of them was just really amazing for the size of them. I love doing larger over, y'all know that by now, overscale ornaments. And so I picked up these beauties. Look at how gorgeous. Look at the detail in these. They're beautiful gold color, true rich gold. And they were $5.99 at 40% off. I got 10 of these, okay? I went in because I knew, again, I took inventory. I've already planned out my things for next year. And I'm gonna be ready, sis, right? I got these. And my only regret here is that I did it. Well, I, I guess it is what it is. But I wish I had was able to get an odd number of these. I have some of them in the champagne hue already that I, I think I got them from maybe Silks of Blooms and then some, a similar version from Hobby Lobby. But these beautiful ornaments, how absolutely stunning are these? They are gold with a little bit of bronzing detail, a little bit of glitter detail. They just scream royal. I love them. They were $12.99, you guys, at 40% off, but I was only able to get my hands on two of them, which I was sick about it. They had some smaller, like the little smaller sizes, but I didn't need that. I needed some larger over scale. So I got the two that they had because I don't necessarily have to put them in the tree. I can style them somewhere else. So I wasn't leaving them. So I got those, right? So that is it on the ornaments. And so now let's get into the revolt of it all, all right? I, oh my goodness. Okay, so for the fellas, and I have uh, several themes. I think I'm falling in love with black again. Cause I, there was, before YouTube, I was obsessed with all things black. Every room in my house was black and something. And so I think I'm kind of falling back in love with the black too. And I picked up this beautiful um, four inch ribbon. It's a velvet ribbon. I'm not gonna take it out of the pack. And I absolutely love it. You guys, it's super thick. So it is definitely a very high quality ribbon. It was $16 a roll at 40% off. And these are five yard rolls, okay? So I will tell you that now when you get into the Ribbon, the higher quality ribbon, most times they come in five yards as opposed to 10 yards. Because I mean, you're getting what you pay. It's the quality. It's the quality for me, sis. I, I will work with anything, but if I can get my hands on some good Ribbon, that's what she wants. And this is just that. So I got this in black. I got two of them. And I'm thinking I probably, because I'm gonna make another trip back out there because a little birdie told me that they have a dollar day when they, because they only open the warehouse up for a certain amount of days per year, and the rest of the time it's just shut down. So I guess they try to sell out or liquidate everything that they have before ending the season. So I picked up two rows of that. If I can go back, and when I go back and they have, if they have some more of this black, I'm gonna pick up a couple more rows, because again, I have a couple of things that are gonna be have a little, having a little splash with a black in it, okay? And so, bringing up the subject of the black, I picked up this. Amazing, can you say Mackenzie Childs? When I saw this, I thought it's a must. And this was a five inch yard, five inch roll in this beautiful checker pattern. But what got it for me was the gold trim. That is what gives it a very regal or high end look to me. And I'm gonna be mixing it with another fun color. You guys are going to love that. And this was $16.50 at 90% off. I probably should go back and get one more roll because this is a five yard roll because a five yard roll it'll do it one tree maybe like a standard size tree but i want to get another roll just to be on the safe side so i may pick up another one of those and another of the black okay and honey when i saw this i was like yes ma'am you're coming home with mama and it is none other than this beautiful uh, i'm gonna put it over here I see now. Okay, I'm gonna put it up here. So you can see, I want you to see all the detail of this pretty ribbon. It's different shades of golds and champagnes and a little bit, um, it picks up a silver hue. So if you wanted to do like your mixed metals with this, you certainly could, but it was all about the gold for me. I love this and it was $16.50 a roll at 40% off. And I got two rolls of this. Okay, love this. Look at, look at how pretty. Mm -hmm. Love it, love it, love it. Look at that. She gonna be fancy, she gonna be fancy. And guys, what did I get here? Oh, I got two. What do you mean? I got two of these, okay. So I got two of those, perfect. Cause I was like, five yards, I should've got two. And I did get two, all right? So listen, y'all, listen, Linda. When I saw this, I was like, honey, I don't, before I even saw the price, I don't care what she called. She come home with mom. And I'm thinking of none other than, oh, look 
this, y'all. Look at how beautiful this ribbon is. It, this ribbon is so pretty. Look at the detail. Look at the detail. It's the details for me. Mm -hmm. Now listen, you, you can certainly buy Dollar Tree ribbon, you can buy Walmart ribbon, you can buy Hobby Lobby ribbon, you can buy Michael's ribbon, Joanne's ribbon, you buy anywhere you want to buy. And you, you can style something beautiful with those with those type of ribbon. I'm not knocking it at all. But I am always going to be a sucker for the high-end ribbon. It is just, it, it, it speaks for itself. Look at how beautiful this is. Can you say opulence overload? That's what it's giving me. So, ah. Y'all, I don't, I don't know if you can appreciate the beauty of what is taking place in this ribbon right now. It is just gorgeous. It is a cream color base with a beautiful, beautiful gold with the champagne. Anything glittery is going to give you like different hues of that shade, which is what I love. So if I wanted to style this in the champagne family, I could. If I wanted to style it in the soft golds, I could. If I wanted to go with the bright opulent golds, I could because of the glitter that's on the detail. It gives me that flexibility to style either way. So... I had to have it. Guys, it was $45 a roll, which is still not bad because Rebone can get up to the $100 per roll, literally. And it was 20, it was 40% off. So I was like, okay, so you're gonna pay about 25 bucks for it. I'm okay with that. This is so worth $25 for me because it's the quality. It's four inch, again, that four inch ribbon is gonna take things to a whole nother level, give you that nice regal, um, upscale look and feel. You're going for a luxe look in your tree. You could definitely do this. If you're not an over the top girl, Run some of this pretty ribbon with a few gold ornaments, honey, and it's gonna talk all by itself, okay? So y'all, that is it, that is all. I hope you enjoy this Christmas and holiday, um, seasonal haul. And I hope you enjoyed me babbling on about being jacked up about my nephews because it was a situation, y'all. It was a serious situation, but I hope that once I put peppermint twists together for the fellas that they like it and that I don't get jacked up no more okay because I'm not trying to be hemmed up in my own house that's not what I want but anywho y'all I'm gonna let y'all go this video has been long enough it's gonna be about 40 45 minutes but I hope you guys have stayed along for the entire haul and I hope you have enjoyed every item that I've shared if you're in the area you want to hit up um the southern home decor if you're in the area also you want to check out the Christmas warehouse before they shut down. They have amazing, amazing decor. Like even at regular prices, the prices are not bad at all. And so right now they're having 40% off and then they'll go down to do a dollar day or like a surplus day, which I'm gonna definitely ride back out there for that. It's about an hour drive, not even an hour drive, but it's so worth it. So anywho, y'all, that's it, that's all. You ain't gotta go home, but you gotta get out of here because now I gotta put all this stuff up. Figure out where I'm gonna put a, a ninth tree because yes, there's nine in the house with outside and inside. There's nine trees, so I gotta figure out where this tree gonna go. But in the meantime, I want you all to stay safe, remain royal, and have yourself a blessed and most beautiful, beautiful day. Bye!